They get ready to come out of turn number four. They get up on that loud pedal. Here we go. So Joseph Jordan tried to get up on the Coke Lay and Decker. Billy Franklin had a great run. Just got the end cut short on that one. So Bo Slate takes it up in high side manner. He'll leap lap number one as they get it into the book. Billy Franklin goes way down to the bottom of the speedway. Coke Lay and Decker, the Floridians are holding ground, running one, two, three as Bo Slate lead lap number two. Coke Lay and Decker in the second spot. Third place, last night winner Joseph Jordan giving chase. Billy Franklin in the fourth spot, the Southern All-Star points leader. David Boyd rocks in fifth, J.R. Mosley running sixth. Seventh is Chase Oliver. And coming through in a hurry is Dalton Cook as he gets up to the eighth spot and gets around Joe Digby. Back off to the one and two he goes. Better as he works into the corners of turns three and four. Jordan is now starting to turn up the wick and give him some pressure. Back off at the one and two they go. They're keeping Bo Slay in his sights. Jorner trying to set him up off in three and four they go. Shows him nose again out of four, but Lane Decker doing all he can to throw it off the assault of Jorner. But as these two scrap it out, Billy Franklin is starting to enter into the picture. So second, third, and fourth is about to be a real showdown. Bosley is keeping his second and third place adversaries at an arm's length as they continue to bail it out. Coming around turn number four on the high speed corner four. We got off the pace and turn two. Bosley with the good restart this time around. So that time, Bo, how about Billy Franklin getting aggressive on that start? Gonna go up to third. Jordan's gonna give it all he can to fight back to the inside of it. And Billy Franklin was able to thwart that assault off, and now Billy Franklin up the third to the Southern All-Star points. Guys are getting into position. Land Decker's gonna slide up. Now Billy Franklin's gonna throw the hook out up to him to see if he can get around the Floridian. That's the Alabama. Hope Land Decker. Can't quite get up to our race leader. As again, Bo Slay has just been just good enough to keep him up at our arm length. Steve Morris pulls off the speedway, so that gives a little more breathing room. Starting to show the nose again to the, the former Southern All-Star Series champion. He knows it's 10 laps to go, so he's gonna really turn up the wick and see if he can get up into one of these podium positions. Billy Franklin trying to keep it nice and steady. Jordan just cannot get enough traction to make something work to get up under the third place machine of Franklin. Franklin good right there off turn number two. They were put about another car length in between, but that car length that he took up, Jordan gets back to the inside of it. Five laps to go in this one. White flag is out. One lap to go for Bo Slade in the rest of the field. Bo Slade drives it in easy. I'll turn number four and Bo Slade going to victory lane for the second time in his career with the Coke and Race and Southern All Star. Second going to Coke Lane Decker. Here's your race winner, Bo Slay. All right there, Bo, come on up here into the grandstand so we can do your interview, my friend. Same with Billy Franklin and Colton. It's been kind of a rocky, long road. And you silence a lot of haters and doubters on this one that you can do it. And I definitely can tell that you proved in yourself you can get the job done, brother. How does it feel to get your second career Coke Performance Racing Southern All-Star win? Man, this one's awesome. I don't know if there's been a better one. Uh, we've struggled. We've struggled. And uh, this team right here, they got heart. Every one of them, uh, man, they stood behind me when they probably shouldn't have. I've let them down and let them down. But they kept on digging. 
Man, David Phillips, gosh dog, man. I mean, I, I couldn't ask for somebody better to just be around. And he's, I mean, he just, just told me to keep digging, that we'd get it figured out. Uh, but, man, that was a hell of a race. Hell of a southern raceway. The track crew done a great job. Uh, can't thank my wife, my two little girls, Fallon and Lenny, enough. Uh, Butch, Stevie, Chris ain't here, man. I'm sorry, but, man, we couldn't have done this without you right here. I know you're on your cruise. I hope you enjoy it. But, man, a lot of this was you right here working on this thing late during the day. Uh, David Phillips, Butch, Cleo, Randy Polk. Man, there's just a bunch of people, and, and, and this does shut a bunch of people up. You know, we've heard it. We've heard it in the back of our ears, you know, just, oh, he can't do it. He can't do it. We'll get you some of this. Mic drop on that one. Let's hear it up for Bo Slay. All right, let's see if we can get Cole Landecker and Billy Franklin up here for their interviews. Definitely shocked a lot of them with a great run. You've always ran great here, but to come in and get second after not quite getting the results you wanted last night, brother, how does it feel? Oh, it's good. We uh, changed a bunch of stuff, so we got the car a lot better, qualified better. Uh, that's what it's all about here. So, yeah, lot, lot, very happy that we uh, made a bunch of improvements from last night. Now, it, you could just stay at about an arm's length with Bo Slay, and it just seemed like turn two was kind of the kryptonite for you. What was going on with you? I don't know. All weekend, yeah, I've been free out of two. Uh, probably me driving. Uh, I've been running a crate car, so uh, I don't know. I'm sure it's me, but, uh, yeah, I could hang with him there. Um, only ch shot I had was a lap car messing him up. Um, but, yeah, I'm happy with a second. Who you want to thank for getting you a... Uh, Second place finish here in this super late model event. Uh, all these guys helping me. Uh, Trent, Blaine, um, Mel and Adam, my dad, my wife, daughter, um, and just everybody that helps me all, all, all week long. Let's hear it up for Colton Landacker, the most consistent man of the weekend. And you conquered Jornerville, as you said last night. <laughs> How does it feel to get your second podium finish this weekend, my friend? It's good, man, the racetrack. I like it. Um, you know, it took rubber again, but you can race on it. I mean, we outrun one of them joiners. So I guess that's a win all the way around. <laughs> now, speaking of joiner, you, on that one restart we had after the caution, the, that, that aggressive streak that we know Billy Franklin for being sideways came in and you got your way up to third there, my friend. What was going through your mind when you made that? The Zippies Autos move of the race. Oh, I was smiling big when I knew I was starting on the outside. I mean, he, no, I love the Joiners, man. They're good people. And when I started on the outside, I just tried to tuck up behind the two. And the 33 come up a couple of times, and I didn't want to pinch him in the wall. I hit him in the back end a couple of times just trying to shove him up through there. But, I mean, I'm super proud. I mean, to, uh, you know, two nights in a row finishing top three, uh, that ain't bad. And, and like I told Todd, we've we made some little adjustments, not really a lot, and that car is just that good. But that's the car I turned over, too. So, like, it's been sitting in the shop and just sitting there, and, I, like, I'm telling you, that's probably the best car we got in the shop. Well, with the mulligan, you've got great points added into you, brother. We're going to see you try to run this out, even with your young son running for Rick of the Year. Yeah, we're going to have to slow him down a little bit. He damn went out through there wide open in hot laps like something crazy. And I don't know. I want to put a shock collar on him or something. He's about to drive me crazy. I can't raise for worrying about what he's doing. But, no, I, I, I want to thank everybody at Rocket. I called Mark Richards, and he, he told us to do two things. We'd done it, man, and that car was just responded like that. And like I said last night, you know, Todd, Todd's uh, – going through a lot and his family's going through a lot and you know a lot of people don't know how that can affect a family when you got a young child like that because I'm telling you if it was mine I, I, I wouldn't worry about no racing the dudes work non-stop like I said last night and this weekend showed it I mean you know whether we're you know tomorrow's Easter and God blessed all of us we're all here he blessed Todd he blessed his little girl she's home from the hospital and you know all weekend and you know a couple mishaps between a couple of people and we might have won one of them so it is what it is congratulations to you know Bo and them they're great people and I'm glad to see them win it let's hear it up for sideways Billy Franklin 